Today, Mom is going to show you how she does our daily and weekly grooming. This is just the general care needed for a Pomeranian's coat, not bathing or grooming. We do go to the best groomer in the world, but we only make that trip every six weeks. So Mom does our upkeep at home. These are like the things Mom keeps in our grooming box. Tell us in the comments, what's in your grooming box? Of course she has a brush and comb, toothbrushes and coconut oil, Bodhi dog cologne, angel eye pads, best of all, treats. A lint roller for herself. And Kong bacon and cheese paste. That stuff is the best. What this? I like it, but I knew mom was fucking tricking me into standing up, so I wasn't falling for it. You like the cheese, don't you? I like that stuff so much, it's worth it. Good boy. Me too, even if she's combing my backside. Mom only likes to use the comb on sugar, but she starts out with the brush for us. Sometimes she sprays the brush and us before brushing, because it contains natural conditioners to help with detangling and conditioning. Good boy. Hmm. Mom starts with a wire brush because it's really good at getting those loose hairs. And because the bristles are spread out, it doesn't pull our hair so much. It still pulls my hair, and I don't like it. I like it. It feels good most of the time. Mom gives me a lot of attention. And treats. Look at all that hair, kitty. Look at all that hair. Oh my goodness. Pomeranians do shed all year. But thanks to our thick double coats, we blow our coats twice. Which means we shed fluffy more hair than normal. Yes, it's called blowing our coats. And that happens in the spring and fall. That is why Kitty and Pixie are shedding so much right now. Normally it's not that bad. Even Sugar is losing a little bit of hair, but not like us. Pomeranians have a double coat, which makes them susceptible to matting, so it's important to brush them often. Mom tries to do this routine at least once a week, but our boy got married, so she's been very busy. Like the more often she does it, the easier it is on us. But I like low-key still hate it. After Mom finishes with the brush, she likes to use a fine tooth comb to get our undercoat. She'll lift up the top coat so that she can get right next to the skin. That is where it's easiest to get matting, so you need to stay on top of this. Get out all that loose hair. Mom thinks using the comb is like the easiest way to comb out the undercoat. Pixie is a little stinker. She's not very good at letting mom brush her. Oh, chill. For real. Good girl. All of our hair is like different in texture. Pixie's hair is a little slicker than Kitty's, so it's easier to brush. Good girl. Are you being a good girl? Are you? Kitty has a super thick coat and his undercoat is more downy. Poor Sugar. She has the least amount of hair and she gets the most mats. Her hair's kind of fuzzy instead of slick like the other two. Sugar's hair is more like cotton, so she mats up super easy. Even when her coat was full, she needed more frequent brushing. So mom only uses the comb on sugar. She has to start at the end of her hair and work her way closer to the skin. That's like how she works out the mats. Some dogs that don't get regular brushing can get really bad matting. In that case, you'd want to have a groomer cut out the mats rather than trying to comb them out or cut them out yourself. Believe it or not, Sugar's hair actually grows pretty fast on her legs and feet. So since we missed the groomer this month with the wedding, Mom is trimming Sugar up herself. Caring for a Pomeranian's coat is a big job. Hopefully people realize that before they get a Pom. Poms are so fluffy and beautiful. That's why literally everyone wants one. He's such a good boy. He's such a good boy. Today took a little longer than normal since we are blowing our coats. We missed a grooming appointment and mom's been super busy.
Still, hmm, then I'll do you right there. Stop it. Leave it. Oh my god! Kitty, look at all that hair! It's like you just had a fluffing puppy. Yeah, and it does feel good now that I'm done. Not really done, because Mom still has our eyes to do. Mom likes the angel eyes cleaning pads. They are gentle to our eyes, and they help with staining on my white fur. Angel Eyes has different forms, like treats and water supplements. We have used those before, but this is all we use now. Then we get our teeth brushed. Mom uses coconut oil as toothpaste, because it tastes so good. Brushing our teeth is not our favorite. Nope, just hand me a bully stick. Now to finish us off, Mom uses the dog cologne from Bodie Dog. Right now we have orange creamsicle. Mom really wants the pumpkin scent for fall. There's your good boy. Mom will spray it on our coats and on our collars so she doesn't have to get close to our face. Pretty girl. It helps our coats stay, you know, soft and smelling like we've been to the groomer. There you go, pretty girl. Now you smell so good. Yes. And now for the best Treats. part. Treats! Good boy. Treats. Mom always throws treats all over the floor for us when we're done. She like loves us so much. Okay, all done. You look so nice. Then mom does the cleanup. She loves those lint rollers to get all the hair off of her and everywhere. All of those tools and products Mom uses will be linked in the description box below. You should check out our Amazon store. We like have lots of cool stuff. Our store is also linked below. Tell us about the tools and products you like best in the comments below. We like to try new things. And if you like seeing things from a dog's point of view, be sure to subscribe.